All right, just a little update here. Um, <laughs> real quick update before I set off for the weekend uh, with the better looking half. But I uh, just thought I'd show you what's going on here. We've got a lot of growth. I mean, that one in the... Let's, let's separate this a little bit. That one in the back has grown tremendously. That has got to be almost 200 millimeters long. Whoa. Focus and framing. Um, what's interesting to me about all of these, again, we've got two separate species here. We've got the pie pumpkins on the right, and then we've got the butternut squash on the left. But what's interesting to me, and I've been watching this, is that all of them are at the same developmental stage within a day of each other. I mean, these are growing shorter. This one isn't as tall as that one. But, you know, each one of them have these initial leaves that came out first and then they started growing these secondary leaves again if you look in close here see on that one see on that one a little bit on that one and that one there that they're all sending out another set of leaves for that vine and that it's awesome to me that you know They've been sitting in a drawer for, you know, since Halloween-ish time, and I just threw them in a wet paper towel, and they are growing. They're not growing at the same, you know, the same height, but they are growing, like, development-wise, at the same rate. So, that's really interesting. Um, these little guys down here, the cacti, they're just sitting there really not doing anything i don't know how cacti grow and we've got this one tiny little pepper plant right here that just decided to join the party um the other ones in the seeds there maybe they're trying to grow maybe they're not and then peel back the covers on these and they are starting to germinate. Those I only put in about a week ago, but it's nice to see I got at least one pepper plant starting to go. And that's, uh, that's what we're looking at right now. 